Hello YouTube and Rumble. This is Intuitive Retta. How are you today? Um, I am going to do a reading on uh, Elizabeth Truss. I just heard that she resigned, so we're going to go into that. I decided Saturday around 12 or 1, I'm going to go live. I'm going to try to go live on Rumble so I can have a little bit more freedom, but I've never been on live on Rumble, so if that doesn't work, then I'll be on YouTube. But um, I'm going for Saturday, so we can have this long discussion, and you guys can have questions, and even personal questions, regards to yourself, and we can have, and, and all that. So, look for me there. Remember, it's Intuitive Retta. I'll try to put the link below to my Rumble channel. So we're going to go in Elizabeth Tress. I just had to sit there and watch my old reading on her. And now that I've seen that she resigned, and I'm looking at the old reading, I could see it coming. Um, throughout that reading, I was acting, well, I was, when I do a reading, it's like I'm talking to that person. So I'm trying to advise her as I'm doing the reading. I see in that Eight of Cups, remember the walking away, I said, oh my gosh, the walking away, does she want to walk away? I see the, the mental um, fatigue. Um, and I was like, but you manifested this. This is what you wanted. But now you want to walk away? No, you got to come and you haven't really made any decisions or, or anything. And now you want to walk away. So I was coming from a place of like, oh, you know, some advice. I was given advice as I was doing the reading. So I wasn't like, oh, she's going to quit. Because I was seeing that she was, she, that, that there was this possibility she was going to quit. But I was trying to put that energy, like that counsel out there, so she wouldn't quit. But we've seen all the problems. She had some mental issues. She had some emotional issues. She had some fatigue. I don't know if she's sick. Um, I also seen there was a disturbance between her and um, Charles. Like I said before, Charles was not going to be like the, the queen. The queen was prim and proper. Whatever she did was in the dark. You know what I'm saying? She didn't make ruffles. She probably made her presence known and her wishes known behind the scenes, but she didn't make it in, you know, in the public like that. Her image, her public image was probably more pristine. Charles, on the other hand, he has this fiery energy. It looks like he's, he's taking this whole emperor. I am, I am, you know, king, hear me roar what I want. So I could have seen maybe there were some, um, problems between her and, and Charles. Um, also a sickness. So I want to see what made her resign. What the hell is going on in England? Because I see, and she didn't make any, I said that she had the possibility with her energy and her birth cards to do anything. She's a manifester. She could have made her, her, um, she could have made her, uh, thing wonderful. She could have did a lot of good if she wanted to, but she didn't. Like I said, she had a choice between the dark side and the light side. And it looks like she didn't want to make that choice. Remember, I said she has a choice. Which way is she going to go? But it looks like she didn't want to make that choice. It looks like she's mentally fatigued. Um, there was a lot of issues. So I want to look. And remember, she's the magician. I'm trying to see if I see it. I know I have her somewhere here. Um, this year, for her, was her empress year. I don't even know what I did with that paper. This was her Empress year this year. So this was a year with the world. I've seen the world card, which is the end of something, the end of a, a era, a end of a, a, a chapter. So maybe that was included. She got what she wanted, but to her, it was the end. So um, where is, here we go. So I want to see where she's at because she resigned. And I feel bad for England because this is like what? This is the second one? Because didn't Boris Johnson resign too? And who was before? Isn't this like the third resignation? Because before that, wasn't there someone else? Who was before Boris Johnson? Did they resign too? Or was it a regular re-election? I don't remember. So let's just see. What's the energy going on with her? And let's see what's going on. If you would like your own personal reading, contact me at intuitiveretta at gmail.com. Make sure you like, subscribe, and leave a comment below. Okay. Attainment. And also, this year was about, you know, uh, attainment, uh, wealth. 
money. Um, the Empress is all about nice things. Um, next year was her Emperor year, business, you know, stuff like that. So, what did she just want to, you know, like a peacock strut str its feathers? I got this. I got this position. I can strut my fe feathers, but it's... Remember how I was saying in that old reading? You can go back and look. I think I did that reading on, like, September 10th. Um, some, don't, especially with the manifestors, the magician energy. Be careful what you wish for, because you, you might just get it, you know? And she attained it, and maybe it was, you know... The, the glass is always greener on the other side. The grass is always... Maybe she, not all that glitters is gold. <laughs> maybe she realized that. Oh, no, this is too much. And she had a lot of masters. So you have the king there. And then she was part of the World Economic Forum. Could have swore I seen her behind um, pictures of her being there and stuff. She had a lot of masters. Maybe it was for the best that uh, she didn't continue. You can't serve all these masters and serve the people, too. So it could be the best thing. So let's see. Uh, Liz Tre Elizabeth Tress. I think I'm saying her name. Was her name Elizabeth? I think so. Liz Tress. Let's see. Where is she at now? This is the moon energy. A lot of behind-the-scenes things. Could be a lot of depression that we were... Um, you seen that in her cards too in my old reading a lot of things that are are being hidden a lot of secrets um, I also was worried about the occult aspect that was showing up in the cards too a lot of rituals so what does that have to do what's the cross to bear with that the celebration hmm so the celebration and and then the darkness so was it the grass was all, you know things all that glitter is in gold Let's see underneath that. The Herald fought. Law and Order came down. Who is this Law and Order? Underneath that was this this political figure or this a minute uh, this uh, this force who believes that their Law and Order came down on her. So underneath it all, remember how I said, you know, some of these politicians they only see sur surface level stuff, right? And then you get into these positions and and you're like, holy crap, this is not what I signed up for. You finally get this PM and, and they they give it. Like how they used to say about how, um, who was that? Was it Barack? Or was it, but I forgot who when they said that. Like the, when they became in power, you know, they have all these ideas. And then the powers that be pull them aside and show them like a, a video of the assassination of like JFK and says you have to do it our way or this is what's going to happen to you so was that who came down and kind of you know she got behind you know and, <laughs> and she realized this isn't for me Let's see she did in the past she did want the three I don't know if they have the three branches of government there's three something she wanted them to work together. The people wanted it. She wanted to. This was her thought. Was to work together for a purpose. To go in the same direction. What's on her mind? The tower event. Right? The tower event. This was the other card that was coming up. But this is upside down. So there's. Is there no fixing this tower event? Was there no ability for her to fix this tower event? Was it kind of stuck? Was there no growth coming from this? Did she not see a way to kind of... Remember I said a tower, something beautiful can come through? Or it can just leave and crumble? Was it just to be left and crumble? And did she not have the strength to persevere? Did she, was she not strong enough to deal with the powers that be? what this crumbling that she can't seem to fix these darker aspects that are going on you know it could be the rituals and did she not have the strength to persevere she's like what I didn't sign up for this and her voice you know her truth her thoughts was that being hindered yeah. So she was on the island by herself. 
<laughs> you know? So, she wasn't able to kind of, she was alone in her thoughts and, and her ideas. She was alone in them. Let's see. There's still, like, there's still no, there's still a pause going on. So we had this, and she wanted some awakening and some movement, but there's not. That could have contributed to the King of Swords. This this powerful man. Could it be uh, Charles? He came up in the Emperor before. Or someone like that. I see this card of illness again. It could be mental illness. Could be mental fatigue. Could be just sickness. And then also, you know, making making this emotional decision. Um, let's see. I just want to see what made her resign. What was the reason for her to resign? Just like this. I don't know if the people seen it coming or not. I could have seen it coming. I seen it coming. But I I thought that maybe, you know, with a little bit putting that energy out there, you know, that she could stick with it. But I could see. Okay. What happened to cause her to resign? The spotlight. The end of something. The transition. The beginning of something. So, the spotlight on a death. Could be the spotlight on the death of... Could have been with the queen. We'll look at that. The spotlight on a death or the... And the magician energy, where which she is, and the unable to balance physical things. So, the spotlight, her being in the spotlight, I don't know if it had to do with the transition of the queen, the magician energy, someone facilitating something, and... The ability to balance like money and physical things. Okay. Is this death the queen? Hmm. I don't know if it's the queen. Um, could be a part of the queen cause an imbalance. An imbalance. I'm seeing a lot of imbalance. And remember, I kept seeing that the people were imbalanced. And people are, you know, it could be that. Also, I'm seeing a lot of people speaking or throwing stones, but not not too much of a real plan behind it. Um, let me see. Is this good for the country that she resigned? She's only been in office for what, like, how many weeks? Whoops! Damn! Hold on. I done dropped all the cards. Okay. Is it good for the country? I don't see how, but... Judgment. It's public opinion right now. The public opinion is like, what's going on? The public opinion, they're also like, what she paid off. They're, they're, they're like, what's going on with the money? So their public opinion is, is concerned about the physical aspects, meaning money, cash, whatever. So the public opinion... And, you know, they're kind of like, what the heck? They've already been broken. You know, right now the British government, the British people are, are, they were at a loss of mental, physical, spiritual, and they're kind of like at this standstill still. You know, they already had the death of the queen, and now this, six weeks later. There's a man that's full. I'm thinking, not able to work together. I don't know if she was able to work together with Charles. Was Charles a problem for her? Was Charles a problem? Or someone that's high up there like Charles? Who else is big up, like big up there? Is Charles a problem for her? Yeah, he was standing his ground. I think so. The rituals... Him standing his ground, these rituals that were going on, these things that were hidden. I think that was a, a problem for her. Whatever she wanted, it was like, it was too chaotic. She couldn't do it. It's like, it was too much going on at the same time. You know how when there's too much chaos, it's like, you, you can't just, 
it's like you can't just focus on one thing. Hmm. How is the new, is there, is there going to be a new PM? How is this new PM going to, going to work? Look at the same cards. I think it's going to be a man. And, um... The queen energy is still there. A lot. Or a woman that's like the queen. Um, I think there's going to be a man. He has all these ideas that he wants to do. Like he wants to execute. He's going to celebrate. And then it's like he's going to have maybe a different type of message. But it's going to be stuck. He's going to be pigeonholed. He's not going to be able to really do anything either. He's not going to really do anything. He can't really do anything um, either. So his hands, his eyes, everything is like a self. He's not really being able to do anything. Um, let's just see how uh, 2023 is going to be for Britain. 2023. How is it going to be for them? A lot of people speaking. A lot of confusion. Um, people are going to be on emotions. The, the law is going to come down. Might be a little bit of um, a revolution. I don't know who. And, and they're going to. somebody's going to stand their ground. I think there's going to be a lot of confusion. They want to hear the truth. Um, I think the people are going to be in their emotions. Um, I also think law and order. If they, if the people act out, the law and order is going to come down on them. Um, I do think there's going to be some victories, but I think there's going to be a lot of pushback. There's a lot of wand energies in regards to the people. Um, a lot of wand energies. So that means kind of aggression, passion, so forth. Um, hmm. Did Liz trust bite off more than what she could chew? Was that her problem? Did she bite off more than what she could chew? I think she was overwhelmed. Um, I also think she made some money. I also think that she was given money. Look at her finances. Look at even in the next year because she's going to start business or she's in the, you're going to see more finance. You're going to see her doing more business or finances next year. So see what it is. Was she paid off? Was she paid off? Was this a lucrative move for six weeks? Of her, you know, serving as this interim PM. Just six weeks. She bit off more than what she could chew. What does the king think about her resigning? Trying to come from this from different aspects. I think that he's given his orders. He was given orders, a message. I think that to keep the chaos, I think that he was helping facilitating her getting paid off. And there's someone else behind the king I think Liz was paid off what does the future look like for Liz and then I'm done if anybody has any other questions about British Britain or what's going on put them out because I don't really know too much I don't really pay too much attention over there so we can look into specific things if you guys want what the heck did I just ask? Uh, what did I just ask? What's the future look like for her? I see money coming to her next year. This year is all about money. She was money. There was money. The Empress is all about money, luxury, abundance. And next year, you see her walking away. She walked away. That was a victory for her. 
A lot of confusion. She, I'm seeing money. I'm also thinking someone came down on her. <laughs> this is what's supposed to be. She's going to go into business. So she's, she's working. So what's coming up to her in the future? She walked away. That was a victory for her walking away. You know what I'm saying? Um, she still has all these things that she wants to do or say. And it's kind of confusion. She was offered or given a lots of money. She hasn't had no real plans right now. Um, also, what's going on with, like, the judgment? Is there a law case or someone coming down on her or the people are watching her or whatever? But I do see her coming together for a business purpose. You know, she has a lot of... There he is. Oh, burdens, the king. I think the king got her to get paid off to end her. So... I don't think her future is that bright. I don't think her future is that bright. I think she got some money. I think she's going to work some deals. But I don't think her future is that bright. Um, I think she reached her pentacle and she's done. Um, the problem is, I think she looked behind the, the, the curtains and didn't like and was scared as heck. And was like, oh no, this isn't for me. Um, not everybody's built for this. Not everybody can take those threats and uh, what it, 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 it takes to maintain and be quiet about it. You know, some people, because you see, look what's happening to Trump. I think there's more he could talk about. I think, you know, for the sake of his family, he can't talk about it all. But the little bit he is disclosing and the little bit, look, he wasn't part of the machine and look at how it's coming down on him. Um, so if you guys have any other questions, I think she looked behind the, the curtain and was like blown away. And I don't think Charles wanted her there. I don't think Charles wanted her there at all. Maybe they didn't get along. Um... Alright, talk to you later. Bye.